guys and welcome to tech design in my previous tutorial we have discussed about counter flange i hope you are understanding and enjoying all my videos on sheet metal workbench so if you have not checked any of the videos please go to my uh, channel and find out the sheet metal playlist so that you will have all the videos in order so in this video i'm just going to explain you how the lofted flange works so let us start the lofted flange as you can see here if you go to more you can see the lofted flange over here this will be works in similar way how to, uh, we have a through curves in surface modeling so uh, let me create a simple uh, sketches for to explain how this lofted flange works i will draw a curve here and this is from the center point And let me constrain this so this point should be on this uh, x-axis and also same like for this let us give some dimensions to this let me create 100 mm and click finish and now what I will do is I'll just create a datum plane uh, at a distance of around 85 mm and click OK and I want to create a sketch on that as well so go to sketcher environment and let me create a sketch so this sketch is uh, almost similar to the one which we have created but it is in a smaller uh, dimension so let us make it as a 70 and click finish so we have two curves over here and you want to create a flange then you can use a lofted flange here so go to lofted flange and you have a star section so we need to select a star section and if you want to give a start point you can just give it uh, if you want you can give it in the other side as well and next we have a end section so end section will be this so as soon as you select this uh, you can see the flange is generated so we have a thickness here if you want to change thickness you can just go to local value and change it to 1 mm or uh, whatever you want and also uh, these bend parameters and relief are already explained in uh, all the commands so just go to my playlist and understand how these bend parameters and uh, relief works so you we have a, a similar uh, one of the different uh, you know option here bend segment so it uh, it is depending on how many segments you want when you uh, uh, make this uh, you know uh, counter you know lofted flange into a flat pattern so i'm just going to explain what is flat pattern in the preview in the future videos so if you want a multi segments then just you can give each multi segment and enter the values here so this will create uh, multi segments when you have uh, you know um, flat pattern uh, so for this this lofted flange i'll just explain it with a one more example as you can see here one curve is in a circular manner the other curve is with a you know a half a rectangle what you can say uh, it is with a you know curves uh, with the lines so what i will do is i'll just go to uh, more and go to lofted flange and here i have to select this flange and then my end section will be this so as soon as you select you can see here um, even though if there is a cross sectional difference uh, between these curves it will create an uh, lofted flange so this is all about uh, lofted uh, flange applies uh, please subscribe to my channel and hit a like button as well as share my videos thank you